What is up everybody? Mark at Vortex here coming at you with a, another episode of Scope This Gun. Today we're talking about my Browning BAR Mark II Safari chambered in none other than the venerable 30-06 topped with a Vortex Crossfire 2 4 to 12 by 44. Now I purchased this gun in the late 90s with my own money. So this was the first gun that I ever bought. I worked hard all summer and I said, you know what I need? I need a Browning BAR 30-06. That's exactly what I got. Now you might see something hanging off the end here that you don't really see anymore. This is the Browning Boss, the ballistic optimizing shooting system. So it acts almost as a barrel tuner or it acts as a barrel tuner, also acts as a muzzle brake. Now I bought this gun primarily for deer and elk hunting. Now keep in mind that I grew up on the wet, thick, jungle-like west side of western Washington chasing blacktails and Roosevelt elk. So at least at the time I was like, you know what, I need a gun that's going to function very fast in tight quarters, potentially running shots, and this was going to be the gun that was going to do all those things for me. But I also need the accuracy like I touched on before, and this thing has all those things, speed, functionality, handiness, accuracy in spades. Like I mentioned before, it's chambered in 30-06. Now you gotta remember in the late 90s, there were basically two cartridges that most people used for all their big game hunting. You were either gonna get a 270 or an 0-6. The 6 was bigger, therefore I thought it was better. That's what I went with. Now BAR stands for Browning Automatic Rifle. So some of the design cues and functionality can be attributed to the work of John Moses Browning in the original BAR. This gun in particular, the Browning BAR Mark II, was a pet project of his grandson. So his grandson worked heavily on the design of this rifle and really was influential in it coming to fruition. It's got a classic walnut stock and foreign, which I find very aesthetically pleasing, as well as a hinged floor plate that accepts a box magazine. Just pop the box in, boom, you're loaded up, ready to go. Now topping the rifle is the Vortex Crossfire 2 4 to 12 by 44. It's a great get it done scope on a great get it done rifle. It's got a one inch tube, a fast focus eyepiece. It's got a magnification range that I find to be incredibly versatile and will handle any of the scenarios that I intend on putting this rifle in, primarily deer hunting here in good old Wisconsin. So there you have it, a quick rundown on my Browning BAR Mark II Safari chambered in 30-06, topped with the Vortex Crossfire 2 4 to 12 by 44. It's been a great gun for me. I have a ton of great memories with this rifle, hunting with my dad, my brother, my grandfather. I shot my biggest blacktail buck at the bottom of a clear cut with this rifle. It's just always been a winner for me. If you have a gun scope combination that you'd like to see, maybe it's something similar to this one, maybe it's not, let us know. Hit us up in the comments on our social media, YouTube, give us a call shoot us an email we want to hear what you want to see and you just might see it on the next episode of scope this gun